Throw this bullshit in today. We are going to be playing. I'm going to be showing you how to get how to get bots on Call of Duty 4. Basically, this is going to be using the same mod on in similar steps to what we did for the World Out for doing with World Out War. Or, but it's not going to be much of a difference other than the other word difference on where to drop the file location. And by that word, I need to drop them off. World at War and Call of Duty 4 are a bit more similar. If I'd probably go as far as say World at War is Call of Duty 4 with World War 2 weapons. But well, that doesn't mean it, it's the same location to drop them off. Like the last one, we're basically doing the Steam location, which I think will become more prevalent in this video for Call of Duty 4. So, let's hurry up and get started with this. So the first step is to go to moddb.com slash mod slash pezbot. So, what you want to do here is you want to go in the mods. Wait, the fuck? <laughs> no, scrap that. What you want to do, you just want to go to mods slash pezbot moddb.com. So, so you want to go to files. So you want to go to down so you want to go down to Pezbot 011p for Call of Duty 4. Now you want to click the download now button. It's basically this downloads for sure the one for Call of Duty 4, not the one for that war. Just show you I already have it, so make sure you click save as instead of cancel. So now what you want to do is you want to go into files. When you close that out. So you want to go to your downloads folder. Which I can just load up through this. So here we have the folder. Just drop it on your desktop. Here's the PezBots folder. It's basically or the zip file. Now what you want to do is you want to extract it. You want to do extract here. You can do it. You can do it with any other method. You can do this. Like I have seven zip two for some reason, so I could. So you can do this as well. Basically same way. Like I like if I'm right or not. You could go into Go to this and do it. Yeah, let's get that one. So you want to go to do this. Extract here. Saw of this. It says he gives you the folder inside of it instead of just bring out the. Well, let me show you. Like if you do extract two. You you basically just get this and it's and if you just in case you do this just drag the folder out. What the fuck? Well, I've already done it anyway, so here's the folder. So if you want, so now it's time to show you where to drop this. I'll drop that back in my downloads folder. Let's 
so if it should fuck me. Oops, yep. So now, here's where you want to go to. You want to go to, to your program files this time. You want to just, so just copy this down. You want to go to your Steam folder and you want to go to Steam apps and you common. So the difference is. For World at War, you had to go into your app data folder, which I'm not sure if I still have it since I had to reset, reset my entire computer. And by that, I mean like I had to really install Windows. So, for World at War, you had to go into like your, like let me show you. Like you used, like originally you had to go for World at War, you had to go into like your app data folder. And then you had to go under here. Go to mods for this. Those are the mods I have right now. Now that was for World at War. For here you just go into your Steam folder. And you go to mods. And this is for you go into this time. For example, I already have the, the mod in there. Well, if you're, you just drop, you would just drop it in there. So now it's time to show you how to use the mod. So now we're in Callie Four. What you want to do now? You just want to load up the mods. And just select PezBot. This. What's that recording? The fuck? No. What's the fuck recording? Yes, no, okay. So now with the PezBot thing, now you want to go to start up new server. And this works with normal Call of Duty 4 and Call of Duty 4X, so just a reminder, buddy. Now it can be any mode, any map. So for this one, we're going to do Kill House. Also, remind y'all, you have to level up again in this one. It's not going to override your multiplayer. Your normal multiplayer stats, but it's going, but they're not going to be the same for this one. It's, you have to level up again. This. So now start new server. You can set these to anything you want. Old school mode if you want shit. Now we're in, so. So I'm just gonna choose a random team. Wait for teams to be ready. Just gonna make sure of something. Okay, it's not fucked up this time, so. What you wanna do is you wanna go into the console. You just basically use the little squiggly key that I feel like to call it a tilde. And make sure you have console enabled under your game options and options. So now we just do slash server or just SVR. It's not server, it's just SVR. I'm just calling it PezBots. And just a, if for no match, you do 11. Now I'm gonna go none. Go we'll try this one. So I see the skill. The skill here. 
the higher the skill is, the more difficult the Pez bots are. So I'm gonna go into. So I'm just gonna make them a bit difficult. Did anything? That yeah, makes it more difficult. Um, you'll see if this works too. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm just all of myself here. I guess that's a great way to level level back up. I just knew a fucking trap. Whoops. I'll be back when this bullshit stops right here. Okay, it's easy over now, thankfully. And yeah, we got nice numbers or as our score, that, that's 700. So basically, found a way to get your XP back. Well, how to get your XP and stuff to be in this mode too. If you're already maxed out with normal multiplayer. It's not cheap because I did it against private, against bots in private match. And also to mention this. I, I don't think you can do it multiplayer here with other people on other servers. But yeah, that quickly ended. It, so, like I said, the commands are basically this. You do 11 for basically a normal match. You basically do the amount of players you want to match. Minus one. That one to count for yourself or... Two if you got another person in there. Basically, the higher number of the skill is. This, the higher this number is, over one, the harder they are. This basically gets you back up to level 55 in the mod, not, not your normal multiplayer. Those are basically the other commands. So, this concludes this. Hope you all have a great day. Shall I see you later?